Hi YouTube, uh, Thomas here. It's uh, Sunday morning. I'm just gonna make this video. Uh, I hope you guys are enjoying the, these uh, little <coughs> little vignettes of stories uh, about me and my best friend Barry. So, uh, if uh, please subscribe and please share the video because um, this is what life is, and I want to just start. Uh, commemorate him and uh, with these little small sh stories hopefully they're humorous to you guys and I got great joy out of them so I hope you guys enjoy um, the conversation uh, the story that I'm about to tell and the stories I've taught in the past <laughs> see that I show I've talked about in the past uh, and they're with love and they're with true friendship uh, so um, I'm just gonna say this uh, uh, please take time to make connections with your f friends and family and, and just enjoy them. And, and if they ever pass, uh, just re try to remember them um, in your own sort of way. So this is my way of, of, of remembering him. Uh, this story comes from uh, 1980, 1982. Um, it's, uh, I'm going to call this the Spanish Rice Incident. <laughs> okay, so um, a little prelogue to, to working with this happen. So, um, my friend Barry, um, he was double dating with uh, uh, his friend. Uh, I'm gonna say Boz. Uh, Boz is uh, um, gone to the Lord, and uh, uh, this is uh, I think it was um, senior junior prom, junior prom, and um, uh, Barry. Um, had a, a, a car and he was uh, double dating with uh, let's say Boz and uh, they t took out uh, some girls for uh, for prom so um, he went to Poly Western High School which is a, a, a magnet school in Baltimore City and uh, it's a big school and they had the, the senior prom excuse me this junior prom and they had dinner there also so uh, amongst the evening this is what he told me amongst the evening uh, beforehand, they had went and got and, and were drinking. Um, you know, he was he shouldn't be drinking and driving. I, I understand that, but he was drinking with uh, with bars and and they you know they got tore up to a degree. So then uh, they met, they went and picked up the girls, and then they drove to Poly Western for the uh, for the, the, the this prom. So. You know they they served the, the the you know this this meal, and the meal had Spanish rice. Okay, so during the course of the evening, you know you you, you dance and you shake around and and you know and, and they had been drinking at that time. Um, I think he was drinking a Black Watch, it, um, also Bacardi. So. Um, you know we could <laughs> they they got toasted and of course there's some beer too so i'm going to move along so uh the towards, towards the evening um towards going after probably 12 o'clock they drove around and they went driving into this graveyard um a big gate graveyard and they drove through and amongst the, this time uh boz had gotten sick what i mean sick is that he threw up on his back seat of his car. He threw up on himself and he threw up on the, the young lady that he was with. So, <laughs> um, and he was he was tore up. So, um, he dropped the girls off and they were quite upset and they dropped him off and he had to carry him inside to his house. So then he was already drunk. He said, I need to clean this up, but uh, you know, <laughs> I'm tired, I'm drunk. So, Saturday morning, uh, about 12 o'clock, he says, uh, hey, uh, I need your help with something. Uh, I'm going to come over to your house. Uh, I, I need some help. Uh, and I said, okay, I'm, I'm your friend. I'm going to help you. So amongst you know, the story he told me on the phone, he said, yeah, uh, went to senior prom, we went to junior prom yesterday, and yada, yada, yada. So this is the problem when I'm dealing with. I said, okay, man, come on over, and we'll work the problem together. So he came over and um, Spanish rice in digestive juices look interesting. It was a bloody mess. I mean, it was red. You see the little <laughs> grains of rice and then they had uh, chunks of chicken because they had chicken there also. It was quite amusing. I, that's all I can say. So 
Um, you know, and I, I looked at him and I said, <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? So, so graciously, I, I helped him and we got the place looking spick and span. It took us about maybe 30, 35 minutes. It wasn't, it wasn't that, you know, that much that I had to clean because he'd already started on it, but he wanted me to, to join in and in to help. So that's what happened. And, uh, you know, <laughs> it was an experience and uh, you just had to be there <laughs> to enjoy this, this this thing. So in the comments, tell me what do you think about Spanish rice and, and what have you had any instance like this? To this day, I will not eat Spanish rice. I was in the, 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 the grocery store and I seen the Spanish rice. I said, hey, that's a story. And I think I, 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 think I will um, talk about it. So uh, the Spanish rice, um, I think one time I had an opportunity to, I tasted like about a teaspoon, but after the experience that I had with Spanish rice, not so much. I'm done. Anyway, you guys have a great day. Have a good week. Um, and uh, I'll give you guys another story next time. So you guys take care and uh, peace out. All right. Bye-bye.